In this tutorial, I'll show you how to eliminate pixelated edges in your digital video footage using BCC DV Fixer. The primary purpose of this filter is to remove diagonal staircasing, also known as aliasing or jaggies, that are apparent in images or clips that have been subject to DV compression while maintaining the overall sharpness of the input image. The filter works by using a proprietary algorithm to detect visible alias diagonal edges that are typically found in DV video clips, and then processes the pixels only along these edges to achieve a smooth, artifact-free result. The filter is easy to use and features an on-screen view mode which enables you to fine-tune the detected jaggy edges prior to performing any image processing. But enough technical information, let's get started using the effect. So, open After Effects, import your footage into a new composition. You can see here we've already loaded an effect that does show heavy DV compression. These telephone wires here, especially, are very jaggied or pixelated. So, next, open BCC6 Colors and Blurs, scroll down to DV Fixer, and double click. The effect is applied instantaneously, and the image already looks much better. But we can fine tune the effect and get an even better result. To do that, click on Preview Mode. Now what you've done is shown exactly where the filter is being applied. White pixels are where the filter is getting applied. Black pixels are being ignored by the, or by the filter. So to get more pixels white, click on Threshold. Decreasing the threshold will increase the number of pixels that get affected. You probably want most of your diagonal lines to be white. Not every single pixel, but pretty close to it. Now if you want to smooth out that effect a little bit, click on Threshold Soften. This will help blend the white pixels into the black ones. This particular clip doesn't really need a lot of softening, but I'll turn it up just so you get the idea. Okay, that is pretty much it. Unclick preview mode and see what you've done. Very nice. If you compare this to how they are before the effect was applied, there is a very dramatic difference. The clip itself might be a little bit shaky, but the telephone lines are nice and smooth. But if for some reason this isn't enough for you, you do have a couple other controls you can adjust. The iterations control affects how many times the filter is applied over itself. So it's default set to 1. You can set it up to 20 times. Keep in mind by the time you get to 8 or 9, your image is really going to get blurred. So probably keep the iterations about 5 or less. And lastly, Pixel Chooser is a way to really control where the effect is applied. In this example, I have a box. Pixel Chooser is only selecting pixels in this box. You can see that the pixels outside the box are still jagged, where the ones inside get nice and smooth. For more help on using this product, you can click on the Help button conveniently located in the Controls window. Every filter comes with a PDF help file attached to it. Or, for more information on this and other BCC products, please visit www.boriseffects.com.